I had a boner this morning. <laughs> boner, he said. Yeah, I just woke up. There it was. Hello. What did you do? Oh, wait, was it uh, Made Up United? Yeah. <laughs> was it Arnie there, FC? Don't exist, Rovers. Was it a couple of me lying pricks, Albion? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, what's the crack? What's the story? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I just got back from Dubai. I literally just got back 45 minutes ago. I got back, put my luggage down, went to the shower, brushed my teeth. <laughs> I just got back and the first thing I want to do is record still game. Record still game. I started traveling from Dubai yesterday at 9 p.m. It's currently about 3, 3 p.m. now. I started traveling at 9 p.m. I got to the airport around 9.30, my flight was at 1 a.m., got to Etro at 7. My coach from e from London to Birmingham was about around 10 o'clock, it was delayed. I got to Birmingham around 2 o'clock, took a shower, so I'm just running on adrenaline right now. And now I'm going to crash. After this, I'm going to crash. But I'm so excited to react to Steel Game. A new season, season 4, episode 1. And I'm coming to Scotland tomorrow. I literally just came back from a 6 days holiday. And I'm going to Scotland tomorrow. I'm so, like, I'm absolutely wrecked. While I was booking my ticket, I'm like, do I want to, I'm like, yes, I want to do this. Because you guys show me so much love. You guys show me so much love. And I'm so thankful. So before I start recording anything, I just say thank you so, so, so much. Going forward, I'm not going to be able to react every single day. I have to tell you guys. I'm not going to react every single day. I'm going to be doing about three reactions going forward. The Steel Game reaction, Father Ted reaction, and also I'm doing a vlog of Scotland like almost every single week and the vlog is gonna be long it's gonna be like 40 45 minutes at least it could be an hour it could be two hours but i'm gonna be going somewhere in scotland tomorrow i'm gonna tell you more about it but yeah sorry about the rambling about i just have to let you guys know i, I can't be able to do every single day anymore i just can't it's not possible so i'll probably do about three four recordings a week sorry guys but i love you and you love me so tell me where you want me to go i'm going to edinburgh tomorrow edinburgh for the first time so yeah tell me where you want me to go in edinburgh tomorrow it's only a day trip i'm wrecked but Mr. Ed, I can't even talk. Sorry, let's go. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Kill Willy. Morning, back up. Morning, Jack. Morning, Jack. Ah. Uh -huh. Oh, I think, let me guess. The breakfast biscuit of this morning is rich tea. <laughs> Please, my friend. Oh, I don't know if uh, it was bourbon creams of mine yesterday, so you would try and top that with the mint viscount. And way off. If you got in a private jet, Jack, you could not get further away. <laughs> get private no. jet. Penguin. No. Blue the band. No. Breakaway. No. Tea cakes. Fox's classic. <laughs> Jaffa. No. There aren't any more biscuits. You've got to think who's out the box and more along the lines of patisserie. Oh! <laughs> Mommy, Daddy, chocolate eclairs. Now, that is exactly what you're after at half eight in the morning, too. <laughs> oh. How's that, Jack? Sorry, sorry. You guys, go check. Have you seen the uh, the video I did with my brother while I was in Dubai? He tried some tea cakes and also some wafers and just some general tonic biscuits and that. And he actually loved it. He absolutely loved it. And also, I saw snowballs in Dubai. I saw snow, literally I was traveling from Dubai to Abu Dhabi, it's like a different city, the capital. I was traveling there, it was about a three hour journey, and I stopped at the gas station, petrol station, and there were snowballs in the corner. Like, in Dubai, and also I seen a poster of Kevin Bridges, he's coming to perform there in a few, I don't, I'm not sure if it's this year, or something like that, but I seen Kevin Bridges, I can't remember where I saw, there's a few comedians that are coming down to perform in Abu Dhabi. You'd be surprised, Give it, you never know, go down there. You'd be surprised. Savour it. Take your time. <laughs> Tea plate. Pastry fork. <laughs> by the way, before I forget, Winston can't meet us for a pint of the day. He's going up to the hospital to get his new leg. Ah, good for him. But bloody time and all. Yep. I had a boner this morning. <laughs> Morning, he said. Yeah, I just woke up. There it was. Hello. What did you do? What do you mean, what did I do? My footer. Oh, shit. Oh, of course I did me. No. No, I just admired it for five minutes. He <laughs> did. Away. I can't remember the last time I had a bloody boner. <laughs> when last did you... Okay, this is a different show, sorry. 
I thought this was my 18 plus show. My bad, sorry. Tell a lie. Judy Finnegan. <laughs> Judy Finnegan? Yeah. yeah, before she went all shaky, you know. Yes, that must have been a while ago. Mm. Ah, well, good luck to you, Jack. That there is Mother Nature's way of reminding you that everything is in working order should you need it. I think it's Mother Nature taking a piss, giving you a bone, and nowhere to bury it. <laughs> what would you do? A big dame came to the door, eh? <sighs> Give me a bone, I know where to plant it. <sighs> well, that's right. I can't I can say that. That's, I'm using it right. Plant it, because that plant's like, you know, burying something. Yeah. Yeah. Literally, I'm right. And I learned something else. Is it bleeder? I think bleeder means weather. Is it means the weather's bad, or it means the weather's good. Bleeder. 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 Blood. It's probably words I was learning, the Scottish words I was, I was listening to. I literally, I use a lot of uh, Scottish words in my vocabulary right now. I do. A lot, especially I can I use that, I say that a lot. I can't do that. I, do, I don't know why. People are like, what are you saying? I'm like, oh, sorry. In my head, especially if I'm chilling by myself and I'm planning to do something. Let's say I was about to do laundry. Nah, I can't do that. Nah, I probably do that later. Mm, can't be asked. Mm. Nah, you know, <laughs> I just... Because I'm I put myself in the culture. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where it was, where it is. Again, it has to be the Irish connection. I feel like I just feel at home whenever I do anything in Scottish when I'm when I'm in Scotland. That's why this channel is going towards that. And I'm absolutely loving it. It's gonna be one of them channels that it's gonna be you're gonna be seeing every week. I'll be visiting, like I said to you, every single island in Scotland, every single city, reviewing different places, reviewing good hotels and then i'll be bringing obviously wales and uk but it's gonna be mainly focused on scotland i just really love it and also ireland for you guys let's continue i'm trying to shoot he said right jackie boy get me squared up pronto <laughs> i know exactly what i do come in get your scants and nylons off there's a wee sherry into the bedroom yabba dabba do <laughs> <laughs> oh, aye, aye. Yabba i think you'd shake yourself <laughs> aye, would i so would you. Of course I would. Good job then, isn't it? Well, right. That there's nobody up banging the door wanting their hole of us. We're lucky. A couple of lucky old bastards. Oh, smashing. Hmm? That'll be some woman wanting her hole off us new. <laughs> Isa, maybe Isa. <laughs> we nerds. Yes, lads. How are you doing, Miss Somebody Dead? We're collecting for the uh, Craig Lang Football Club. Nice touch. No, no. Use my name. Personal. So, what is he got today? You pick a number and write your name in the back here. Back here. Then, when all the numbers are took, we cut them up and put them in a tombola. Oh, a tombola. Ha ha, a tombola. If you win, it's uh, £20. Pound. And the rest of the money goes to jerseys for the team. Well, I must say, that sounds smashing, lads. Oh, hold on, I just want to get my pal, because I know he'll want a piece of this. Jack! Get on here. <laughs> the boys here are collecting for the uh, Craig Lang football team. Oh, aye. Mm -hmm. Apparently, what you do is you pick a lucky number and then they cut them all up and then they put Bullshit. them. Bullshit. Um, what was it you call it again? A tombola. A tombola. A tombola. Yeah. And you can win 20 quid. Mm -hmm. Where is it Craig Lang football team play again? Uh, down at the green. <laughs> oh, that's the it's green. green. Aye, aye. What green's that? The one, the one just down there. Did you not get beat last week? Ha ha ha, if you did die, you get beat her. Who was it that beat you? Yeah. Well, no, you must remember, it was only last week. Oh, wait, was it uh, Made Up United? <laughs> no. Was it only their FC? Don't exist rovers. Was it a couple of wee lying pricks Albion? <laughs> Put that in your tumble, oh. you wee bastard. <laughs> <laughs> My God, it's so true. Like I've never done it actually, because it's actually a real thing. We used to do it, but I never went around. All I did, I just get my parents to just give me like ten euro, and I just get them. I'm not, I can't be asked going around. I go, but you do know there used to be wee nerds in Ireland that do that, and they get they get loads of money because they go to the older people that are just you know. I don't want to use the word naive. They're not naive. They're just nice. They just and they, obviously they just believe it. But like people make loads of money doing that. They just pretend, yeah, it's charity. Football team, they're traveling abroad, they're going lords. There's always something going on. But obviously, the older you get, the more you get used to. It. Obviously, Jack and Victor, they probably did that when they were wee nerds as well. So that's what they knew. What's all about? Again, it's so good that I can relate to this. If I couldn't relate to it, I'd be like, what the? F I don't find that funny. But I can relate to it. So that's why I really enjoy this show.
Him just sitting there, Eric. Eric. Me? I know. Mind if I join you? I'm going to get a wee cup of tea before I start at Navid's. Bloody parched. Never get my normal cup of this morning. Fuse with a wee in a kettle and always take a cup of tea in the morning. Pitch it right off your side that, didn't I? When you don't... Sorry, parched is thirsty, isn't it? I think it is. I think I've heard a few times. Thirsty or hungry? I think it's thirsty. I think it is. Get it. That first cup of... <laughs> 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 is it tea or is it coffee? You take, Eric. Uh, tea or coffee? No, it's petrol you drink, ain't it? Petrol? Aye. <laughs> oh, aye. That'll be the new lassie then, is it? That's her. The lovely Rena. I don't know about that. Her skits will be up in her ears and the chest don't as ridiculous. Oh, aye, I hate that. <laughs> She's a widow, too. What difference would that make to you? She's about 45. She's not going to look at any of you, you daft old buggers. Hi, <laughs> sir. Look. Oh, hi. I was wondering when you two would show up. How's that? Didn't hear Oakland, the new lassie. What new lassie? Rena, the new lassie. I didn't know there was a new lassie, did you, Victor? No. What can I get for you? You can accept a warm welcome at Craig Wine, sweetheart. We wish you every success in your new job. Good luck. Two teas, please, sweetheart. Oh, that's lovely. That's really lovely. For fuck's sake. And it's Jarvis and McDade pulling away for the pack of deadbeat loser asshole. <laughs> Chocolate flowers, Eric. It's the only way to fly, son. There he is. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> is that you, Jeffna? The geese are our own playboys. I am. <laughs> what a player. Just came in. <laughs> Jack and Victor be pissed. <laughs> <laughs> What's his leg? Is it gone? Can you not read? I, I can read. I can read perfectly well. Says Nosmo King. <laughs> yeah, he's a good guy, Nosmo. <laughs> <laughs> Broke my wrist at work. Thanks for that. I didn't ask you. Where's your leg? You're not really reading that, man. <laughs> You're just pretending to read that so you don't have to talk to me. <laughs> it's, it's a woman's magazine. <laughs> mate. Yeah, mate. Yeah, mate. It's a woman's magazine. <laughs> mate. What is it? Where's your leg? It's no here. Where is it then? I don't know. I got it cut off because I smoked too many fags like you when I was younger. <laughs> you smoked your leg off, man. <laughs> ah. <laughs> what are you talking about? You well, your no, leg man, off. no, man. You smoked your leg off with too many fags. Wait, like this? <laughs> I don't think so, mate. Mr. Ingram. Oh, that's me, son. Oh, are you in uh, here, mate? What is it? Mind you don't smoke your other leg half an hour, right? Aye. <laughs> 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 oh, oh, oh. Right, Doc. Let's get a look at this new leg. Well, I tried phoning you this morning, Mr. Ingram, but you'd already left. Um, there's a wee bit of a problem. Oh. <laughs> You've been my strips. Oh, that'd be smashing. Put your purse away, my mate. Do you know what? That's right. Something similar happened that I was so close to interfering. I was at a train station, and there's this, there's this geezer. He goes on, he has the same story every single time. 
like when, when I moved to Birmingham, he he tried it on me, and I, I almost gave it to him. I used to give I used to give homeless people so much money when I first came to Birmingham, but now I don't anymore because I've given people money and I see them I like a few weeks after just and that sh- that just annoys me so much. Like even when I ask people for money, I'd rather buy you food than give you. I'm not giving anyone money anymore. I'm not. I'm not because I've just. It, it just, it, yeah, sorry, it just gets to me. So yeah, there's this geezer, he goes around to people, he goes, oh, sorry, excuse me, if you have 30 cents, he does that with everyone. And because you know, no one carries 30 cents. Most most of the time, you can have a pound or two pound, but he does the same thing to everyone. He's like, oh, sorry. Like, oh, sorry, I'm, I'm trying to get a bus. I have 30 cents. Every time. And he did it to this lady. And you know what's crazy? He did it to this lady, and the lady goes, oh, sorry, uh, I have a card. The lady goes, oh, sorry, I have a card. And he, he went, oh, sorry, there's an ATM right there. I lost it. I absolutely, like, inside, I was fuming. And I think the lady, like, I had to keep walking because I was my mate Tyler. I said, you know what? I don't want to see the lady walk. Cause she kind of, like, looked like she was about to walk to the ATM. I'm like, I'm not watching it because it's pissing me off. I'm just going to walk away. I hate people like that. It's so annoying. Oh, get, get a job. I'm sorry, but get a fucking job. That sounds mean, but yes, it, it's annoying. Because it's a bloody corn, isn't it? Yes, you little bastard! <laughs> what is it with you, eh? Praying on bloody pensioners. I've tried to get myself some money, lads. You're gonna end up in a pokey, boy. It's a couple of quid just now, but that's only gonna lead to bigger things. Jack Strait bag snatching, armed robbery. Aye, ah, diamond heists. <laughs> no, it's, a, it's a slippery slope. You need to get yourself on a straight and narrow. Get yourself like a girl friend or something. Aye, that's what you should be about at your age. Pictures, dancing. Aye, walking in the park and that. The good stuff. You got a girlfriend? Oh. We like that lassie, but what's in the cafe? <laughs> what? The big redhead? She's old enough to be your ma. Oh, no, that one. She need the one at dizzy tables. Oh, aye, the real lassie, aye. Well, there you are then. Ask her. Yes. No. Who? Oh. Oh, can't really know what you say, lads. Rubbish. Just hit her with a young part, eh? A <laughs> very young part, eh? This'll be good. Right, give some of that, Jack, then. Hey, right, yeah. Um. I like the PlayStation. Do you like the PlayStation? <laughs> Glad you hear you laugh, Nick. You do any better. Have you heard all the new rapper music? I've heard it. And I like it. <laughs> I'll give you that. That's, uh, that's good, eh? Oh, that was pish, man. <laughs> oh, there's that, is it? Jesus, look at the state of her. She's hot for that in a vids to spill the beans about Rena and Willie. Well, let's beat her to it and put her nose right out of joint. Come on. You, keep your nose clean. Oh, and good luck with that, you lassie. David, guess what? What? Nicky here, Nicky. Eliza, shut up. You're telling the tale. You know, big Zena's a red head at what's in the cafe. Shut your hole, Eliza. Just for once, I'd like to hear a bit of gossip. No from you. Well, I was sitting in the cafe having a cup of tea. Get your brush. And go behind the beads. Yeah, wait a minute. Behind the beads, Isa. <laughs> Will you get behind the bloody beads, woman? <laughs> Gentlemen, the floor is yours. Right. Hey, uh, hey, Victor. Oh, not at all, Jack. Are you sure? I insist. Right. I was sitting in a rendezvous cafe, right? I'd rather than you bobbing in the cafe with Snog and Willie Reed. Sorry, it's too good. That's <laughs> oh, Christ, that's a banter. Ah, she's been in here. She's a big honey. Ah, she's lovely, aye. Eh? Who do you suppose the attraction is there, eh? Ah, there's no money. He's not got two bob. No, he's a scrounging bastard. Always asking for tick. Well, must have a smashing big gawk. <laughs> <laughs> She's got that smashing back here, something play of Tanner Car, haven't you? Two in a block, fill a hen's teeth. She'll be after these hoots. Willie, Christ, look at the state you're in. Are you riding a bike, Willie? Aye, it's a gift from my girlfriend. <laughs> aye, aye, we saw the pair of you doing at the cafe, aye, aye. Chris, she's off your age, man. So what? It's love. She's moving in with me. <laughs> Are you no a bit old for a bike, Willie? Nonsense. She got me a bike. Keep me fit. Keep you fit for what? Oh, you're not actually. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not your business. What the thing do you ask? I would never discuss anything personal like that. Any condoms, Navi? <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing at it. 
<laughs> oh, nothing, nothing. Sorry, Billy. Ask again. I won't laugh. Condoms. I'm needing condoms. <clears throat> Ribbed or flavoured? <laughs> Flavour. <laughs> Get it up, yes! I've got your boot! Fair play to him. Tam, what's Tam doing? There's somebody lifted my pint, Bobby! Where's my pint? Jeez, oh! Hey, you're there for a quick piss and you come out and some lousy bastards whisk your pint away! You didn't have a pint, Tam. You've just came in the front door. The Lord loves a triot. <laughs> Is that him, boy, Eric? It's supposed uh, to be mince and tatties. Mm. Tatties rock hard. Mm -hmm. Mince or watery? Aye. Nay, oxo. Nope. Salt? No. Tasteless. Aye. Pint of lager, Bobby. Two pints, Bobby. Thank you, Eric. Oh, Winston, did you get your new foot? I did, aye. That's good, Winston. Now you can have the two shoes on. Two shoes, Eric, aye. What's the matter with you? <sighs> Nothing. Give me a pint of lager, Bobby. <laughs> oh, look who it is. Phyllis and Diller. That's going to be the worst yet, you toast pot. Because <laughs> Phyllis Diller's one person, no two. <laughs> Normally when we come in, Bobby, you get, look, it's Batman and Robin, or Laurel and Hardy, you know. Double X. What you said there's like saying, look, it's Frank and Sinatra. Aye, I'm Bob and Hope, but that's a battle. Aye, knock yourself out, son. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> look, Jack, it's Lawrence, Lowell and Bowen. <laughs> you pinch your prick. Oh, is that your new fit one, Sinatra? Smashing. Oh, is it comfy? Oh. You getting a boot? Just realise I'm not wearing my jumper. I'll usually wear my two pints, your prick jumper. Actually, should I wear, should I wear that to Edinburgh tomorrow? I don't, uh, I don't think Edinburgh is a place where, I feel like Glasgow is more, I don't know, I, see again, I don't want to judge, I haven't been to the place yet, but what I've heard is that Glasgow is more of a, you know, nice, posh, lovely, you know, but Glasgow's, uh, I mean, Edinburgh's like that, and Glasgow's like, yeah, come on, let's have it, well, Glasgow was, was it, I don't know, let me know, should I wear my jumper to Edinburgh, my two pints, you prick jumper, let me show you, if you haven't seen it, let me show you, two pints, you prick, this one. Yeah, in case you haven't seen it before. Should I wear this tomorrow to Edinburgh? Two pints. Yeah, prick. Sorry. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, let me know. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think. I don't... Because I, I, I might be walking past the castle. I might be going to the castle. I'll probably be inappropriate, isn't it? Probably over here. You all right? Aye. Keys are looking at. Eh? No. It's a foot. I've never seen a rubber foot. It's no rubber. Was it a good match with other again? Aye. Can you wear shorts? Let's see it. Go and get it out. Oh, come on now. Leave the man alone. Aye. He's just in for a quiet pint. He's not one to show it off. Take your shoe off and let's see it. Aye, come on. Get it out. <laughs> I don't want to see as well. There you are. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Makes sense. Yeah. Cheers. Tenants. <laughs> He had rest juice too. <laughs> You've had your jollies in the pub. It's not the foot ones, then, it's, uh, it's the nails. What's, what's the deal with the nails? <laughs> Tell you, it's the only one they had.
bloody NHS. It was either that or wait forever for a man's foot. Could get a marker pen and draw hairs on it, bitch it up a bit. <laughs> get a rest. <coughs> no, it's, um, it's a bonny foot, Winston. Well turned ankle. Sexy. <laughs> it's depressing, that's what it is. Who? She's sitting in that hospital, right? With all the other decrepit old bastards. In beds and in chairs and on sticks. I'd never seen myself as one of them. Well, that's what I've become now, isn't it? I mean, what next? The other bloody leg. Nah, you're not one of them, Winston. Aye, Jack's right. That's all no change anything. Yeah, I mean, you've lost half your leg, big deal. I mean, that's hardly you in the scrap peep, is it? When life hands you melons, make melonade. Lemons, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> melons, you prick. <laughs> See, oh. <laughs> Look at that. See, this is why I said it. This is why I love this show. You get the joke part, you get the real life part. This happens in real life. This can happen to anyone at any time. This is why, God forbid, if something like this ever happened to me. It's not about this kind of stuff happening to me. It's about who's around me. Do I have the right people around me? Is my family going to stay beside me? That's, wh that's what that matters. So no matter what you go through, you, as long as you have the right people around you, it's going to be grand. It's going to be okay. Don't worry. Okay? Don't worry. Actually, let me show you this picture quick. This was me in Dubai on a, on a bike. Look at me. You see that? Hey, uh, what's that now? <laughs> see me? <laughs> Lovely, isn't it? I absolutely enjoyed it. I was on the, literally, I was on the bike with my dad, my brother and sister. Everyone just having fun. It was beautiful. It was absolutely beautiful. Sorry, family means everything. Just love it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Speaking of melons, eh? We've got just the thing to cheer you up. Oh, hey, put your socks on. We're going to the cafe. Right, <clears throat> where am I looking? You see what I need? Oh, yeah, I see him. What about him? He's shagging. Huh. Where <laughs> you go, you pair of do lally bastards. <laughs> Oi, Christ almighty. How about that? Randy old bastard. Party. Have you asked that of your last year? Ma. There's your chance going, mate. There's your roll. Thanks. <laughs> Is there sauce on it? Aye. Is it red? <laughs> Thanks. Right. <laughs> Boys, so you might want to hear the latest. I was up at the high street this morning pine my phone, and who do you see staggering out of curries carrying a big heavy telly? Willie. And she's at his side carrying nothing, sweating him us. And if that's no enough... Jesus, as mayor. Eight o'clock that lives through their wall, telling me he was up all night, banging. <laughs> oh, well, good for him. <laughs> oh, hammering and sawing and banging. Oh, Kaiser, what's your point? I think she's got him doing too much. I think she's trying to bust his wee ticket and keep that hoose. Where is it you think you are, Isaac? Cabot Cove? Who are you? Angela Bloody Lansbury? <laughs> Aye, Black Widow Pish. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Hello there, Willie. Hello, lads. What's that you're drinking, Willie? She's got me on it. A Red Bull. Says it's good for me. My heart's... No, really, I don't think, no. I don't believe in all this. And, like, I'm not a big fan of energy drinks. Don't get me wrong, I have a monster, like, once every two, three months, but these energy drinks, they're bad for you. Oh, my, the amount of shite inside there. Oh, my God. There's so much shite, in my opinion. In my opinion. Let me know you guys drink it. Like, like I stay awake enough. Like, if I drink this kind of shite, oh, oof, I don't want to think of it. Oof. It's gone like a train. <laughs> I haven't slept in two days. <laughs> <laughs> See you. Two days. Very cynical, Eliza. The man's in love. He's not the only one, Jack. <laughs> Already? Eliza's talking at her ass. Aye. Bloody black widow in Craig Lang. 
It's only the daft woman that works in the cafe. Aye, and Sweeney Todd was just a daft barber. <sighs> Be the way to go, but eh? Pumped to death. <laughs> <laughs> the only way to go. With a big smile on your face and you can't get the lid of the coffin doing. <laughs> Tex billionaire. He was pumped to death with his wife that eh. And then a cool smith. Oh, the big blonde, eh? Well, here, give me your money. Right, feel my diddies. <laughs> it would be bad news if it was. Well, here, give me. Pumped to death with his wife that eh. The lid of the coffin doing. <laughs> Tex billionaire. He was pumped to death with his. Was that the playboy? No, that's the. That's not you, Jeffrey. That's not a geezer. Ah, oh, what? I can picture his face. Small old man. Ah, that loads of grey hair. Where was it from? What's his name? He could barely talk. And I think she, when they got married, it was about 80, 88, 89. And she was about 20. It was obvious. That's what I don't get. Like sometimes, if it's obvious, you can tell this gee, this lady is trying to get, just trying to take your money. But obviously, I feel like you have to be in that position to get what's going on. Like not because I'm young, I've got a girlfriend, you know, I've got people, someone that, you know, we're still, you know, in our prime. I'm not going to really understand until I get to that age. Do you know what I mean? So that's why I try not to judge people. But sometimes, like, you're going to lose billions or millions. Well, I have no money, so that's why no one's trying to go dig me. Makes sense. His wife, that, uh, Anna Nicole Smith. Oh, the big blonde, eh? Well, here, give me your money. Right, feel my diddies. <laughs> <laughs> it would be bad news if it was true, but... If it was true. Big green a shagging Willie out his house. At his age? Your house for your hole. <laughs> That's a no-brainer. <laughs> Ain't a lager. Aye, I'll be next in the queue once she's finished with him. Imagine that, eh? The last days of your life, you wake up and you've got a big dolly bird lying next to you. <laughs> well, you do that already, don't you? Wake up, look down at your lovely wee woman's foot hanging out the door. You painted tootsies, morning, sweetheart. <laughs> Next you'll be looking for a wee plastic horn and a fake wig and tits you could shag yourself to death. I'll stick this woman's foot up your arse, Bobby. Oh, oh. Easy now, Winston. Yeah, don't rise to it now, Winston. <laughs> That'll learn you, you bastard. Oh, no. <laughs> She was loving up that council estate that Agnes Bell could help me to get pumped down. Yeah, yeah. So she needs Valley's house. Oh, Jack, Victor, everybody thinks it's a big joke. And I'm thinking, <laughs> is it me? Am I the crazy man here? <laughs> Naveed, <laughs> Naveed. I'm not listening to you, Isa. I'm listening to my iPod. We're <laughs> not going bullshit to somebody who gives a toss. <laughs> Oh, bloody week. She's trying to kill Willie. She's trying to kill Willie. Big green after the cafe is a murdering cow. <laughs> Did you hear any of what I was saying, Tiz? Uh, no. Quality. <laughs> what can I get you? Big box of matches. Matches? Bottle of methylated spirit. Spirit? And a packet of jammy dodgers. Uh, four pounds seventy five, please. There you go. Thank you. What's going on? <laughs> An elaborate trap, huh? First she lures him into the basement to a trail of jammy dodgers. <laughs> then squish! Poof! <laughs> uh, I'm beginning to think that you're not so crazy after all. <laughs> yeah, that'll be Winston Bard doing the cleanser for a wee while, eh? Mm. Zane Falk. Yeah. He hasn't got a leg to stand on. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, there she is, eh? Oof. Yeah, I know I'm being a sexist pig and all that, but 
There might be a man in Craig Lang that wouldn't give the right cheat to be hanging out of that big dame the night, eh? Mm. <laughs> I know exactly what you're saying, Jack. Good uh, luck to you, Willie. Uh, happy hunting to you, man. Getting a long step, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Stand back, please. What happened? It's been an accident. My ass! <laughs> it was no accident. She killed him. You keep your voice in, Hen. Mr. Reed's been off sir, just now. He's very upset. Mr. Reed? Is he no Jean? <laughs> She's dead. I was fixing the aerial. Lost my footing. Ended falling off the roof, crashing through the greenhouse. Bruno must have came running down the stairs to see what happened and fell. Snapped her neck like a twig. Are you okay, Wally? I'm fine. These wounds are superficial. I don't know what happened to me, Dave. I loved her that much. You're a big honey, aren't you? What's your name? <laughs> you like the, the rapping uh, on the PlayStation? <laughs> <laughs> Hey! <laughs> You're getting the mood then? Aye, oh my. Aye, right, good. Well, I buy a ticket to the Craig Lang Football Club. Aye, all right, son. When's the draw? What the bloody hell are you doing? We thought you'd stopped all that, eh? Conning people out of money. Trying to help you. Get your girlfriend. Keep you a bother. Aye, I know, man, but I need the dough, don't I? My bug's up the duff. <laughs> Pregnant. Is that what that means? Up the dot? Does that mean his girl is pregnant? I think. I must have heard that song before. It's not like an Irish saying as well. It could be, could be. But yeah, that episode, season four, episode one, <laughs> Willie. <laughs> I thought he was proper sad, but then the new girl, the girl, the girl's actually taking care of him. He's trying to make a move on her. Do you like PlayStation? Do you like rapping? Unbelievable, unbelievable. I'm glad I actually I um, reacted to that. I'm absolutely wrecked. It's been, I feel like I'm starting to crash. In the last five minutes, I'm like, yeah, literally, I'm going to edit this stuff, edit this uh, recording. Just go crash. I'm, God knows. I, literally, I feel like I'm sorry from jet lag. 100%. 100%. But <laughs> yeah, I absolutely love that. You guys want to see more Steel, uh, Steel Game? You know what to do? Comment down below. Subscribe. Please, 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 please. Check out the Patreon if you can afford it. Check out the Patreon. It's going to support all my journey to Scotland. I, literally, I told you guys I want to go through every single island as much as possible. I want to go everywhere as much as I can. So yeah, if you want to support me, check out the Patreon. Check out the membership. Comment down below. Let me know where you want to go to in Edinburgh. If you're in Edinburgh tomorrow, if you own a uh, a little coffee shop, a little restaurant that you want to try out, please, please comment down below. I'd also do like a little community post to tell you guys, you know, I've been in Edinburgh. So yeah, comment on that where you want me to go in Edinburgh. That's that's that's, that's public in City Centre that you want me to just, you know, have a little quick nip, you know. No, I'll be like, Isaac, come here, try a little shirt. I'm trying to shirt now. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.